Oh hi so this time we would learn how to uh, import data from ms word so this is a, a file in uh, ms word format so you see that uh, uh, this file uh, so there are in this file there are uh, many variables and uh, and these are the observations on these variables so you see that uh, the variables uh, means the observation on these variables are not aligned so you see that uh, here you see that this is not aligned the uh, column this column the date column years uh, it is uh, starting from here you see so so it it would take a lot of time if i try to arrange this it would take so much time if i try to arrange each of these so actually what happens uh, many a times we happen to have uh, uh, data uh, uh, in this uh, format so many times it happens that the data is uh, in the form of uh, ms word file so what should we do to uh, import it to its data so one thing that uh, we try to uh, take it to ms excel file then we can do it or we can uh, actually data uh, uh, is very uh, efficient in doing all these things so actually i want to show one thing first that uh, uh, for example this is uh, uh, ms word file that is, is that is in the dot rtf dot rdf that is word document so it is in the form of word document and has try to bring this to into status so what should i do for example if i use this uh, uh, in sheet command uh, in sheet command for example if i use uh, in sheet uh, this is in sheet command if i use it and uh, do it see file demo one dot raw not found so even if uh, i write uh, dot rtf so which is the extension of uh, uh, ms word file so what would happen see dot demo rtf not found because uh, this data does not read all these extensions so what should i do to import this file to data uh, what I would do that uh, I would save it as save it as uh, into a plain text so I have I have selected plain text means I am going to make it uh, change it into a text file so when I click so appears here so uh, what uh, being seen uh, let it be there so you simply press ok uh, don't align the column don't align the column because it has uh, uh, you see that there are uh, nine letters it has only four letters so this is why it is not aligned so it is natural so uh, now what i do i write clear then i write it here demo one this is the file name this is the file name and i write the extension txt so this is the ex extension in which i have now saved the file so now when i press enter you see seven variables 180 observations have been read by this data so how can we see we type uh, list command you see list command is here list command 
so when i uh, type this command and press uh, enter you see that all the data is here all the data is here you see everything is uh, very well aligned though it was not actually aligned in the original file so you can see that uh, everything is here so stata makes it uh, very much uh, uh, easy for uh, all of us to import data to stata so this was from uh, uh, ms word file so now let's see what should we do if we uh, try to import data from my excel file actually usually what we do that uh, we uh, select the uh, all the observations and we go to um, stata we go to stata and uh, we paste it uh, sorry uh, we paste it here we paste it here so copying and pasting actually uh, is is not uh, preferable because it is very much error prone and also it takes uh, so much time for example if i uh, demonstrate that how uh, importing even from uh, uh, excel file is very much uh, easy so i think you you would not be uh, doing this thing that copying and pasting so for example this is my file this is my file and uh, what i do for example if firstly i show you that it is in uh, doc dot xls file it in the dot xls uh, it is a spreadsheet format and it has dot xls uh, extension so now it is excel uh, usually excel workbook excel workbook so this is the file name and i press enter so actually i change it so using your data uh, in ms excel what happens that uh, it is uh, just in this uh, format it is usually in this format x excel workbook so now if i go to stata and try to bring this file uh, named uh, uh, i write uh, what was the name uh, name was uh, name of my file was book 2 okay so it was book 2 so for example i write book 2 i write book 2 and i also write the extension of uh, um, excel file and when i press enter so it says that book 2 dot xls uh, couldn't be found so this is the error uh, has been given by stata so now there is a method very much uh, this is very much simple for example this is my file so instead of co uh, copying and then pasting to the data editor what i do that i simply change the extension means i select tab delimited i select tab delimited so this is what i'm going to select so if i select this and then i press save so now and i stata stata i simply write this is the file name in sheet command using book to txt so this is what i have written this is what i have written and when i press enter you see that 11 variables 180 observation now if i press list command this is the list command so when I press enter, you see all the uh, observations are here uh, and it also has all the uh, variables and you can see in the data editor that yes, we do have 
all the observations here. So, it is very much simple uh, uh, importing data from MS Word and MS Excel using in sheet commands. So, I must uh, recommend that use it. So, thank you.